Hey everybody, welcome to another episode of Epic Arma. I want to remind you guys that that secret project thingy that I never, uh, that I haven't told anyone about with Epic Arma is going to be online tomorrow. So look forward to that. It's going to be very different, and I hope you guys will like it because I will probably make it also a separate sort of series, not every week, but um, because it, it takes a lot more time to uh, prepare to make. Um, but yeah. Let's talk about the scenario that I made today. Um, ba -da -ba -da -da. This is the defense of Devil's Castle. I made this to kind of test it out how it would work with the zombies because people wanted to uh, wanted me to make a scenario where we had to like hold out when z zombies were coming. Uh, the problem, of course, with zombies is they're not very fast, so you have to uh, have more numbers. So what I did is we are here in Devil's Castle, which is a giant fort. And I am a grenadier, and I am here with in total 50 other um, blue four units, and we are surrounded by uh, 400 up four. So it's 50 or 51 if you count me. 50 versus 400. So there are 450 AI units on this battle, and um, man. It is going to be a slaughter. I mean, I, I tested a few times. I have not even... I mean, we're, we're getting massacred over there. It's going to be interesting because usually my missions begin when everybody spawns at the same point when it's laggy. And then it becomes less laggy over time because everybody spreads out. Here, the case might be that it becomes a little bit more laggy because everybody is closing in on each other. Because of the AI mod that I'm using, um, you will see a lot of smoke screens. Uh, people will... Um, throw smoke grenades a lot and the line of sight is increased too so they will probably engage at a further rate so here we have it devil's castle and everybody's now kinda taking position I put the up for a little bit far so that you wouldn't get you know the the massacre starting immediately A fun thing is though that um, Armor 3 has also been released so that creates new opportunities for Epic Arma and uh, I had just the most brilliant idea that I'm also working on right now. It's not the secret project but probably after the secret project I will probably do the regular Arma and then I'll do the thing I'm working on now with Arma 3 which is just, just hilarious to me. It's, it's, it's amazing what you can do with that engine. And I'm really happy, actually, with this this whole series with Epic Arma because it's being watched very well, and it's it's almost like the second series, or the series next to you know the Battlefront mods that's now well watched. Where here I can actually be very creative, where with uh, Battlefront, uh, which I love, don't get me wrong, but I review what other people make, and here I can make my own scenario, or my own situations. And of course, your you guys' suggestions are still very welcome. I, yep. We are being attacked. I uh, noticed that this place is the most secure. Obviously, there are a lot of ways to do this map. I mean, you are surrounded at all places. So if you want, you could also... I'm now at the western front. You could also go to the eastern... There! Oh, shit. We got him. Oh. That guy's dead. There you can see some of the smoke screens. They throw grenades also more often. Where's the thing that I hit behind? I think it was this. Ah, oh, this is bad though. Enemy will also do that the same, by the way, with the smoke screens. But this is not good. This is a bad thrown one. I don't know if it's friendly or enemy, but. can't see that part now very well. Oh shit. Okay. 
And so I guess this kind of gives you a good idea of what the zombie situation would also be, zombie mod. The problem is, of course, that they are all slower. With the zombie mod, you can actually choose if you want zombies that move slow, or infected that move quick, like in Left 4 Dead. <gasps> Jeez. I don't know if that's friendly. Is it friendly? No, it's friendly. It's a pilot. Don't know why I put them in there. There will come a moment of obviously when Op4 will start marching into one of the sides and then we're completely fucked because I'm now watching the west side again and if they attack from the east I'm completely screwed. Some uh, some graphics which is obviously Somebody in a previous video said that he wanted the PBO file, which is basically the file that you put into the missions map, the single player missions or multiplayer missions. Um, oh. I'm so sorry! I, I wanted to shoot that guy, but... <laughs> but yeah, no, so you put that, that, that file in the, in the map with the... Um, or in the folder with maps, and then you can play the scenario that pretty much were made by other people, so you could play the scenario as well if you want to. Uh, is there any interest for that? Like, do you feel like you want to play this map that I made? I mean, all of these scenarios that I make here are nothing, like, special. I mean, um, there is a case like this where you have to defend a post, which is done way better with, like, defenses and barracks and sandbags and everything, turrets, instead of this. This is just, I, I make these maps to create scenarios with a lot of units. Oh Jesus, okay. Did you hear something? Yeah, I was shot, asshole. Cover yourself. <gasps> it's a Russian dude. Oh shit! <sighs> Let's see if I can get that asshole. Yeah, fuck! I'm hit. Now my aim is completely fucked because I had to hit my hands. Ah, I got him though. Still have a grenade launcher if I must. Shit! But for example, also with the PBO, with the maps, the reason why, for example, this map is also not that good is, um, you know, I th this map won't automatically end. I didn't set a trigger for it to end. I thought at first to do that would, like, have a trigger when there are no op for it left in the vicinity. But then it becomes kind of a drag because you have to kill literally every soldier, and if one or two of them are stuck... And glitch out or something, you gotta search the whole perimeter, so it's kinda no. But they have entered the fortress. Oh, look at that, blue smoke. Oh god, okay! Fucked up my leg. I can still walk though. It's my hands that are hurting, weirdly enough. Are they shooting at me? Yup! Never 
Never mind. Never mind. Can I? Wow, this is dangerous what I'm doing right now. Oh my god, look at them all the way over there. Oh my god, he hit me! What an asshole. I'm pretty sure that most of the other guys are dead. I think all the fire is directed at me. God, it is impossible to fucking shoot them now. No, I got him though. Got that one too. Even though I'm using the AI mod, they will unfortunately not enter this building yet. It sucks. Oh my god, I was hit! No! Well, guys, that was it for now, though. Like I said, tomorrow, something very different, something very special planned. Look forward to that. And I will see you guys next time.